No, I don't need the other light on, do I? That's all right. It's all right. Ow. It's got a sore on my leg. Mm. Oh, thanks. Did you hear that, people? Yeah, Miss just said I'm a sore. That's not nice, is it? You call me a headache. You are a headache. You're pain in my butt. Hi, one person watching. Could you tag my Tony, please? I am there, but I'm not there. Cause he can never get on. Hi, Kelly. Kelly, will you tag my mum, my Tony, and Alfonso, please? Look at the end of this. Look at it. Look. I don't need chopping off. It's like mega long. We bought a petrol strimmer. You bought a petrol strimmer. You're gonna cut me hair with a petrol strimmer. It might, might, might break the streamer and all. Hi, James. There you go, Katie. It's getting a spot. I did ask to... Oh, God, I can't even talk. <coughs> <coughs> Hi, James. I'm going to do Alfie's of the pod. Well. Hmm. I've lost a piece of paper. Oh dear, oh dear, oh pants, hang on, there it is, hey, Tony's tagged them, Kayleigh, thank you though, right, this has got tape, this is a Hairberry cross chocolate butler, and I'm really scared of it because the other day I ate it, didn't I, and I was fine, and then I put the kids to bed and I was fine. I came downstairs and I had to crawl around the floor for a bit. I was like, oh, I really, really got like mega, mega bad cramps off us. It was weird. I don't know if it was um, bad cramps or if it was the shock of cramps from one pod. I wasn't, did the, uh, knock, knock me a bit sideways. And I think this one looks gnarlier than the last one. Hi, Grandpa Stu. And I think I've seen fill in. Can you see? I always think my camera's a bit pants this way around on my phone. Some days. It's, it's a bit uh, pants. Oh! Yeah, this is a Hairberry Cross Chocolate Butler. James. I'm not looking forward to at all. Top off. I'm just going to take that little bit of calyx off because I don't like the look of it. Which is not me at all. Don't I normally just you. chomp it, but. Don't just cheat. Amy! And this pod was having a baby pod look, can you see? I've just lifted it up there. Okay. Can you see? Little baby pod look. I reckon the baby pod's gonna blow me head off. There we go. Right. Um. <coughs> I don't want to, Stu. I'm scared of it. I am. <laughs> I don't want to do it. I don't want to. It's getting a little bit. It's not soft, but it isn't the freshest anymore. Right, let's have a look. Oh, thanks. That is flour. Jesus. The top I have took the top off. I'm dreading it in the neck bit. That is really, 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 really flower. Hi, Kevin. I wonder I might say this one's warmer, mate. 
This one's making me drool. Wow. This is a hair berry. Oh, pardon. Kelly, I don't even like chilies. I'm sick of telling people. They just don't listen. Um, uh, 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 this is a hairberry cross chocolate butter. Is it called a hairberry for a reason? Yeah, because it's hot. It's not nice, James. <laughs> not as nice as the chocolate cross with a hairberry. Oh, wow. Oh my god. Oh, when the right man decided that flower would probably be good. How did you get that? Wow. Yeah, kill it. <coughs> oh wow that's hot eh that's a lot hotter than I didn't know the other one wow wow fun though See, Kelly, they're all laughing, look, because they don't believe me. Oh. Oh. Wow. And if I get a kick in the face. There's only one thing you don't like, and that's celery. I really don't like celery. Me neither. Two things celery and marmite. Maybe I don't like celery because it tastes like flowers. And I don't like floral pods because they taste like flowers. Right. <coughs> so. Um, I don't think it's hotter than the other one. I think the heat hits you quicker than the other one. This is all just in my mouth. I don't know that I've got time to develop. <coughs> it's a bit, bit better now. Um, if you heard that, that was my daughter. No, she's got a dirty bottom. Yeah, I think it might be building. Um. Yeah, yeah, Irina. Um, the one I done the other day was a chocolate butler cross hairberry. I don't want to chew a chew up the stew. The other day, the other day was a chocolate butler cross hairberry, and tonight it was a hairberry cross chocolate butler. And they are two totally different pods. This is all. Like the back of the tongue, not my throat, my throat's fine. And as I said, my mouth was fine, but it's like, like, where you, where your mouth meets your throat, like tonsil area, but not the tonsils, just like the bottom bit. Does that even make sense? Yeah. But it's also in the chest, I'm getting wicked up there already. Ooh. There's no tears, I don't think. I don't think I could squeeze anything out. Now, oh, I definitely. Oh, I'm spitting. Um, I definitely prefer the first one. I definitely prefer the chocolate or the chocolate butler cross berry <coughs> because the flavour was a bit better. What about the heat? Compare them. But I think the heat was hotter on the other one. I think the heat on this one was quicker to come in. You just think you need that full glass of milk? No, I think I only need like a mouthful or so because I've got wicked heartburn. Really wicked heartburn. 
No, I don't like I've just gone on for me. I like I like my knees. I like these things look. Like they're like little pieces of chalk on them. Yeah, they're like little pieces of chalk. Little pieces of heaven when you're dying. Hi, Kim. <laughs> Heather Pillars and Pingers mentioned me in a comment. Oh, there, look. Hi, Heather. <laughs> the notification came up across the top before she commented in the bottom. <laughs> that was funny. Hi, Heather. <laughs> that was funny. I like that. Um, fill me J box already. Look, look, me with your J box that don't look like J box. Hi, Shani Lou. My J box already full. I'm not eating one now. I may eat one over the weekend. I need to eat lots of pods this week. Big things happening at the weekend. Big things happening on next Saturday with me and Heathen Raider. Three o'clock UK time. I think Heathen said it's um, nine o'clock where he is, but I don't know where he is. <laughs> yeah, Heather, the, <laughs> the J box, but they don't look like anybody else's J box. So, they're just really, really strange, man. And it's the first chilli I've grew. Because <laughs> Tony normally does it for me, but I wanted that one, so. We had to be weird, didn't we? It was the first goal. <laughs> it was my first goal, it had to be weird, didn't it? It had to be strange. So, that was a Hatebury Cross Chocolate Butler. It's not getting any hotter in my mouth. It's not getting any hotter in my chest. I don't know, Stu. Because I've got plans with Heathen and I've had plans with Heathen for a few weeks now. So I don't I don't want to like mess it up doing a Moab on the Friday and then not be able to do what I'm doing with Heathen on the Saturday. Because I've promised Heathen from weeks ago. If that make, Does that make sense? Yeah. You planned with him before you... Yeah, yeah so I don't know... I don't know if I can do the Moab next weekend. And you I feel absolutely awful over it, but... Maybe the weekend after? I don't know. It's hitting the belly now. Wow. That was a burp. That was a big burp. That was a from my belly burp. Mm -hmm. And there might be another one in a minute. I'm not sure. Yeah, it's definitely, it's right down now in my belly, it, below the boobies and below the chest and everything, it's sitting in the belly now. Probably another one that kicks you in the guts later on. Yeah, it's probably going to be another one that kicks me in the guts later on. I don't know if it's going to stay in, to be honest. My tummy's are, uh, Telling you it's coming out. yeah, it's churning a bit, so it might not stay in. Mm -hmm. I agree, Heather, there is a lot of chocolate in a Moab. But I, I can, um, I've done a Moab, I'm just not very good at eating it, quick. Um, the Moab's alright, I like the boots. It's making me burp, it's making me windy. Let me have a little glass of this milk, see if I can settle. Then burp is down a bit. In my dad cup, look. I'm the best dad. Best dad in this house. Nah, no, Stu can't do Sunday nights. Like, I can't do Sunday nights because the school night. Why can't you do Sunday nights? Because Stu's got to be at work. I'll go School night. You're 30. This is school night, there's another bath. Um. Yeah, it's made me a little bit. What do you want? What do you want? What do you are you putting them with the other thing to be given away and doing a bundle or not? What's the idea you like? Uh, well, I can't do it if you don't tell me what the idea is. He's been a dinghy, he's trying to throw things at me. Uh, don't you uh, uh, Wow. 
That's really windy. I never tried to sell me my tray paper, but the winter's coming. Link into the description. Right. And look what we've got. Look at these, it's little Buster. It's little Buster bird. <coughs> They're rather cool, look as they go. They go over your ears, and I've got a fat head. I've got like a big fat round meatball head, and I've got all that hair up there. So go on my ears. So if anybody would like a beanie. Does not match my t-shirt, I've got my... You've got dad's. I've got my, right? It's really confusing, this t-shirt. It's Superman and Batman. Look. Superman and Batman t-shirt. So, I've got a few of them left. A few meaning about, I've just sold one to Kev Tilly, so I think I've got about 10 left. So, if you want one, you best jump on them quick. I love beanies, Heather. I love hats. I love hats. Show you my favourite hat at the minute. Pom pom hat. Yeah, my pom pom hat. <laughs> this is my favourite hat at the minute. It's got a big old naughty pom pom on it. The kids say that my pom poms make me naughty. Look. <laughs> can you see it? And if I can feel it wobbling when I'm walking, then it just makes me do silly things. It's a naughty pom pom hat. Might not be now. But I love hats. I'm strange like that. I hide behind a hat. I like to hide behind hats. Um, this chilli's making my fingers feel weird. Ha ha! Heaven loves my pom pom hat. It's got naughty pom pom on. It's making my fingers feel weird. The chilli. If you come here, I'll whisper in your ear what it makes me feel like, but I'm not telling that lot what it makes me feel like. <laughs> Well, have a think, right? No, it's all right. What might make my hands feel nice? Yeah, right. And what might make me put a hat on my head? Right. Right. I like hats. Amy has... Um... Go see if your brown hat's down there. You've got chocolate all over your face. Jesus. Does any... You can have a thousand grand if you know what it is. Amy's got a Baker Boy hat. It was these the bikes. It was my hat, but Amy stole it. <coughs> wow. That was not good. Whoa. A thousand grand if you know what it is. No, I was looking for the Baker Boy hat. That makes you look like a choo choo train driver. Oh, that one. It's not your hat, it's my hat. That's bent on my throat. I bet made me throw up bad. Here's my mate Paul. Paul's my friend, you know. You've seen these before, really. Paul's my mate, Paul Oro. Yeah. He's my friend. This one? I've hung out with Paul. Yeah, that one. Are you ready for my other hat, Heather? I've got a house full of hats. A house full of hats. That one's mine. But Amy stole this off me because she said I look like a choo-choo train driver. You need your black one. I don't know where the black one's gone. Same look. This is my other hat. I have a house full of hats if I was to go look and like... I reckon I've got more hats. Than a hat shop. No, I reckon I've got more hats than t-shirts. If I was to go look them. And I've got a lot of t-shirts. You want that one? I'm putting this one on. I need a hair dye. Look, I need a hair dye. Me too. What's the link you've just shared? Oh. oh, you want me to tell people that tonight there is a crunchy challenge with James Nixon and Grandpa Stu. It won't be on Facebook. It will be over on our YouTube. It will be over on YouTube because... Then it's easier for my tangent to get the links. If you get them the link off YouTube, then you can't accidentally get them the one off Facebook. And then it's easier for them and it is easier for them because I know how much of a... It's not a pain, but it does take up quite a bit of time. Because you've got to download it from Facebook to upload it to YouTube. So it is... And the amount of videos he has to do, I can imagine are uh, quite a lot. Hats are awesome, Heather. I love hats. I love hats. 
I love them. I've got a League of Fire cap somewhere. I just don't know where it is. Where are they? Wow. Paul Orwell feels uncomfortable with a hat on. I love my hat on. Do you know, Paul Orwell is the only person on the planet that has a beard and I'm not scared of. <clears throat> is that what it is, do you think? But Mr. Robinson's at mini school was neatly trimmed, it's just it was down here somewhere. And, oh! I didn't like it. And I don't like Robbie's over there. This is all. I don't like beards. But... Is it because they're tattered? I don't know, but Paul's beard doesn't scare me. Oh, is James doing five crunchies tonight to get him to the top of the league? Three, I think. Paul says five. I don't think he's got five, I think he's going for three. Ah, oh, Tony says he's not got five. There. Me and Heathen Razor are doing some special with crunchies next Saturday. <coughs> so, what time are we on YouTube tonight? 7.30. Half past seven. What time is it now? Me phone's there. Half past six. So, in an hour, over on YouTube, go to YouTube and type in Nuke to the Eds. You should find us from there. Um, and then just click on the live chatty bit. We'll all be over there supporting James and Grandpa Stu. And then I think everybody needs to stop buying these crunchies because of mine. Because it's my new favourite challenge. I like it a lot. So, I'm jibber jabbering now. No. I've got no mouth burn, I've got no chest burn, I've got a tiny bit of heart burn, but nothing I'd want about. So that one was definitely, I think it tasted worse than the other one. But it was nowhere near as hot as the other one. I think the other one, the burn lasted longer. Cause it, cause on the other one it creeped down and then creep back up again. Where this one it just hit you in the back of the throat and that was it. Hopefully, hopefully, she says hopefully, it won't get me in the gut like it did the last time. Are you eating half that one? I Minnie's mean, trying to steal all of the chocolate brownie. No, she better Look. not. There's these two pieces left, and Minnie says, Can she have all of that? No, skinny well, can fat kid. Can I have half of that and all of the other one? No, you can't. Skinny fat kid. You're not the only person in the house. She's my skinny fat kid. You good the brownies to eat. <gasps> More brownies? No, you can't eat the brownies. Why not? Yeah, Minnie. Have a Moab collab. I want to see you eat that. Don't get me at that. No. I actually did this in the book. Can you hear her? Can you hear her? She thinks she's great because she ate a full chilli the other day. It didn't nick up. It didn't nick up. What she's not telling anybody is it was a habanada that she ate. I you know. Ate a full chili, didn't nick up. Leave me alone. Amy sits and eats like handfuls of them in one go. Because Amy's a little beast. Minnie's like, I oh, bet the chilli. I oh, bet the chilli. I know you did. So. You'll see me lots this week, chomping pods, because this also happened, hang on. Look at my notice board, see if you can see anybody you know. Uh, I can see you. This happened. And this is full of, uh <laughs> nasties. Little pumpkins, look. Little pumpkins. You know somebody's not going to show. Mm. I'm not eating one. No, 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 no. Chocolate pumpkins. Hi, Ben from South Wales. And, but then there's like... Gnarly ones like that. Stu's just private... private Stu's just private message. Paul Oro and said he's going to do five crunchies and get to the top of the league. <laughs> You let me know when I'll send them down. <laughs> you will not send him no crunchies, they're mine. It's my favourite. And then we've got like gnarly ones like this. Because when you say to Steve Dixon, can I buy some pods? It really, really doesn't joke. I am from a tiny little town called Hartlepool. Ben. In England. Look. 
That's bigger than my head, look. If I hold it there, look, look. Bigger than my head. But then there's nice ones like this. Because I think this is a Cox jalapeno. But there is some... Uh, Hey, Foggy. Nasty, isn't he? Hi, Foggy. Look. So there's some uh, interesting videos to come. Very interesting videos to come. Oh, look, everybody chatted all at the same time then, so I missed them. I know that. I'm from half an hour away in Cardiff. Oh, cool. Just up the road. Ben is just up the road. He's in Cardiff. Or down it's the road. Down the road is Cardiff, isn't it? Yeah, that way. And then, oh, hang on, there's a different type of one, look. It's a little flying saucer. Look. It's got the aliens in. I don't think that's all there is worth in there showing you. <coughs> Do I know Bridge End? I've heard of Bridge End. I think that might be a Reaper. I don't know. So, next week we'll have some. Uh... Look at that. Next week we'll probably watch me die. And Stephen laugh at me. Because these are off Stephen Dixon. I like Stephen Dixon until he sends me chocolate pods like this, look. Like that. That's where I'm from. I love the pods. I don't even like chilies. People just think I do. I'm going to get a nuke t-shirt, right? That says, Adele the Brave. And then your nuke logo and across the bottom it's going to say, I don't even like chilies. I think that's what my new... Yeah, I think that's what my new, new t-shirt should say. James, you're not on at seven, you want to have by seven to be I want to sit here and talk rubbish, I'll sit here and talk rubbish, mate! Yes! And anyway, there's 15 minutes yet. Because it's only quarter two, it's not even quarter two, it's 22. Seven. What? Not last seven. That's right, I've just said half seven. But you need to get off seven, she's just waffling. I know, I'm just waffling. I like to talk to people. Me too. People are lonely, we're all on lockdown. So I'm just spreading my little wings and talking to people. Right, I'm going. So don't forget, half past seven, YouTube, Crunchies, Stu and James. Just Stu and James, nobody else. Uh, if anybody else has got a Crunchy and wants to jump on it, it's Friday. Did you hear that? If anybody wants to jump in with a Crunchy for half past seven, message Todd. <coughs> ben, you're the first person to ever say that to me. <coughs> he loves my accent. Where people normally say to me, are you from Newcastle? No, thanks. That annoys me. Or they'll go, are you a Geordie? Nah. No. No, 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 no. It's Teesside Girl. And yeah, I'm waffling. Uh, wow. That was a chilli burp. Ooh. So Alfonso, this one tasted worse than the first. Pod you sent me. It wasn't as hot as the first pod you sent me. Amy, throw your man back in the cupboard under the stairs. But it's a lot more windy. Do pods make you windy? Yes. Yeah, because this one's made me more windy than the last one. I'm burping more. I don't like to burp. Right. I'm gone. Bye bye, peoples.